My name is Sam Callius. Um, I'm from Boston, Massachusetts. I'm 21 years old. Um, I study psychology and Italian at the Catholic University of America. I don't particularly want children ever, really. That's not something I'm super excited about, not something I'm like thinking about right now or really in the future. Um, I don't think there's anything wrong with that. Uh, I know a lot of people always ask me, oh, but why? Like, not that me, I can't just say no and leave it there. There's always has to be a reason for it. And people always say, oh, no, you'll want them later. You'll want them later. And I'm like, okay, but I don't. <laughs> um, is there a specific reason why you don't want kids? Uh, I think the big part is it's a lot of responsibility and there's a lot you can, like, have, being a psych major, knowing what goes into taking care of kids and what goes into it, I just don't think that I'm well suited for it. So it's based on your own discomfort mm -hmm. and your own, you know, like your own fear. Yeah, it's my own issues with what if I screw them up. <laughs> <laughs> uh, so what do you think about other people in regards to their um, inability to have children or their choice to not have children? That's totally up to you. If you want them, more power to you. If you don't, awesome. I don't think there's an issue with it, but I do think a lot of other people do have questions about it, do have issues with it, are constantly like, but why want a reason? Because it's not necessarily the norm yet. But I personally, it's entirely your choice. It's a very personal decision and you should make it what's best for you, not just because somebody says you should. Yeah. Are there other people in your family who have made similar decisions? Yeah, I have um, an aunt who doesn't have any kids. I have... Um, a bunch of uncles who don't have kids, never got married. Um, for my family, it's pretty standard to choose your own life path, do whatever works best for you, personally. Okay. Um, if you could say something to a person who completely disagrees with you and you think it, thinks it's mandatory to have children, what would you say to them? Hmm. That's a good question. Um, what would I say? Why? Why do you think it matters so much that I have children? You can have as many kids as you want. Why do I have to? Um, there are plenty of other ways to be a parent. You can take care of other people's kids. You can run an organization. You can support other people. You don't necessarily have to have kids yourself. So there's no, I don't think there's a need to have children if you don't want them, because you can be a parent. You can be a mother, a father in a different way. So would you say that you're completely opposed to having children for yourself? Or is it just something that you would prefer not to do? Just something I would prefer not to do. If it happens, it happens. I, I'm trying not to, but <laughs> uh, something I would definitely be more, I'd rather not, but okay. not strictly opposed. <laughs> I think it's definitely a bigger issue elsewhere. People can say no. Um, we don't really have a really low birth rate, so it's not like a political issue at this point. It's more just of a what people are expected to do, but it's not as big of an issue as, say, in Italy or in elsewhere. My family's from Greece, so it is a big issue in Greece. If you say, I don't want kids, it's a big issue, and I don't see the same response, the same reaction in the United States. Childless feels a lot like there's a loss, that there's something you should be doing that you're not doing, almost like a, a crime in a way. Whereas child free is, it's more of a decision, a choice, rather than something that is expected. And it's more, child free is more of a, um, I guess, has some nicer connotations and is um, more, accept and more, more accepting and more open than the word childless. I think in English, not so much. But I feel like in Italian, there isn't really a word that captures it that doesn't have something negative, doesn't mean something ugly, something mean. Whereas in English, you can just say, a sing uh, you could say a single woman, you could say a woman, not a mother, but there's nothing as heavily connotation in English as is in Italian. I have a, a lot of friends that are in the same mindset as me, like, not thinking about kids. I don't want them right now. That's a thing I'm gonna think about later on. But I do have um, a lot of friends, especially at this university, that truly believe 
as a woman, you should have children. That is one of your major, I guess, points of existing is to have kids to generate children. But generally, I find it's more on this campus more open that people will be like, I just don't want them right now or I don't want kids. And we can talk about it in a pretty civil way. You can talk in pretty civil with both sides. Um, but on this campus, you do get both. Uh, my mom is a teacher. <laughs> She's a professor and she used to teach childcare and kindergarten. Um, she doesn't really care how I feel about it. Um, she just hopes I don't become a crazy cat lady and have 12 cats instead of kids. <laughs> but she's, she's okay with it. So is my dad. They don't overly care either way. They think it's my choice, my decision, my life. I can do what I want with it. I have a Greek grandmother and I have an Italian grandmother. Um, both of them, well, my Greek grandmother is really not okay with it. She is really mad that I'm 21 and not married, but that, I think that's a her thing. <laughs> uh, she wishes that I would want kids and have lots of grandkids, but my Italian grandmother is happy to support me with whatever decision that I want. So if you could say one thing to your Greek grandmother who's opposed to your views, um, what would you say to her? And what would you ask her? I would say, does it make me less of, well, I would, I would ask her if it really does make me less of a person, less of a woman if I don't want kids. And I would tell her, I'm all about trying to make my life what I want it to be. And I would really appreciate if you would support me in achieving what I want to achieve, whether or not that involves children and making me happy.